Hello everyone, this is me Satya here and I'm back with the bonus love read. This reading is going to be for the sign of Pisces. Topic of the reading is what are the true intentions of your person towards you, towards the connection that they have with you. Um, I will be adding miracle cards as well in this reading so stay tuned. We might also tap into the uh, nature or feature of your person as well so stay tuned. Uh, before I dive into the read, let me remind you that it's a general read. It may and it may not resonate with everyone out there. So always pick the signs and messages that uh, resonate and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well. So let's see. What are their true intentions for you for the connection that they have with you? Whoever it is that you're currently dealing with. Let's see, what are their true intentions? Seven of Swords, Knight of Pentacles. It seems like, you know, you are dealing with someone who has been running away from commitment, relationship, expression of love, confession of love. Um, but always, you know, they had strong feelings for you. Uh, this person has been very deceptive around, you know, their true intentions. I feel like, you know, they always have feelings, emotions, but they have been trying to run away from the fact. They have always been hiding their actual emotions for you. Uh, this person really wanted to go slow about this connection. And I feel like, you know, for majority of you, with this person's energy, it seems like, you know, they do have... Um, they do have fear of commitment. They do have fear of, uh, uh, you know, getting too attached. So whoever it is that you are dealing with, um, you might have been in on and off relationship with this person. What this person do is uh, they take take one step ahead with you, two steps backward. One step ahead, two steps backward because they do have fear of attachment as well. So they would want this connection to go slowest at the slowest pace. Why? Because uh, they don't want to get too attached. They don't want to take any decision which might hurt them in in um, in uh, you know future so this person has been very protective of their feelings for you so if we talk about their true intentions um they would act completely different than but deep down they wanted it to be stable harmonious since forever you might not ex you might not see that coming from your person's attitude and behavior because they don't want to um be vulnerable to get hurt so they would always hide behind their you know, um, sexual uh, energies towards you. They would always act as if they are so cool with the, with the just having friends with benefits or something to do with that without having any commitment, commitment done in the connection. So I feel like you know, that's your person's energy. Deep down, they have always been attached to you. They have always been interested in you. They have always been having this intention like, you know, we will see where it goes. But yes, they, they tend to have one step ahead, two step backward. Let's see more cards here. Uh, the Wheel of Fortune, Eight of Pentacles. Um, this person has a habit of thinking and overthinking as well. Like you know, again, the more they overthink, the more they get, they basically get scared. So I feel like you know, this person really wants um, this connection to go to the next level. But yes, they want to invest into it slowly but surely. So if you are somebody who is uh, impatient, this person will definitely have issues with you because they don't want to rush into things. Maybe you are somebody who's impatient and you want to take things to the next level quick. Uh, or maybe you have been with this person for some some years already and you really want now things to move forward. But again, the more you are ready to take things to the next level, trust me, your person is going to go slow around it. So if you really want it to work and want it to go to the next level, you have to take it easy. You have to stop worrying around the future. Try to enjoy the process that you're having with your person right now. Because I feel like you know, this person really intend to have something stable and harmonious with you. Uh, but yes, I feel like you know, since they do have their fears um, and uh, you know issues uh, on personal level, you will you'll find this person to be acting kind of weird uh, most of the time. Um, but yes, they are their happiest with you and they do, they do love being with you. Um, they do have a tendency of getting too attached as well. So I feel like, you know, that's something that they run away from. I mean, the deck we do have the Queen of Pentacles. This person really sees you as somebody who adds a lot of stability to their life. You are that happy, sacred home of this person that they enjoy getting back to from work, from the pressure and stuff that they are dealing with right now. 
So for majority of you, if you go slow around this connection, I feel like you know you will be happy that you did because your person is going to value you for what you are going to add to this connection. Um, let's see the nature or the feature of the person that you are dealing with. Let's see what do we get to know about it. Just to give you a reconfirmation of your person's energy. It can show your energy or your person's energy as well. So just be mindful. For some of you, the energies could be reversed. Women, intelligent, single, but hurt in love, bitter, intellect, oriented it can be you it can be them subtle features quite modest mysterious wise counselor innovative again it can be you it can be them as well so let's see the oracle cards now let's see what the oracle has to add to the read for you guys let's see abundance enjoy the bounty of life your supply is unlimited blessings are coming to you so it's very important for you to start enjoying the life that you have with your person trust me the abundance will come through when it comes to this connection stop limiting yourself to one specific kind of relationship that you want to have with this person that leads towards marriage or something like that just try to enjoy to the fullest uh, whatever you share together because this is something beautiful and this shall be celebrated on each and every level uh, try to enjoy the time together. I do see a lot of passion in this connection. So passion, do what excites you. Go fired up. Um, uh, get fired up about your life. Increase your energy levels. It's very important for you to get excited about whatever you share with this person. Rather than like, you know, getting so caught up in the idea of when is it going to go to the next level and stuff like that. Because I feel like, you know, if you, too, uh, if you get too obsessed with when will it go to the next level, when it will it go to the next level, it's just going to... Um, make you more stressed plus it's not going to add anything good to your life with your person so it's very important for you to understand that and start enjoying what you share with your person instead of getting worried around this connection that when will it go to the next level and stuff let me take some more cards here <clears throat> let's see what else is uh, the oracle guidance for you Except criticizing one another will only lead to further unhappiness. Love and accept each other as you are and your relationship will magically transform. Again, when you start enjoying the life that you share together um, and stop worrying around certain things and stop complaining about certain things, everything is going to start getting better in this connection. So it's very important for you to stop complaining about the issues that you're having. Try to enjoy every bit of your time together. Uh, and you will see that every good thing that you desire out of this connection will happen once you start enjoying uh, living in the moment rather than worrying around the future that you seek with this person. So um, yeah, that's pretty much it coming up for you for this read. If it helped you, do like, share and subscribe till I do the next read for you guys. Take care. Bye.